What do you like about the YMCA? My name is Nan. I like to play with Play-Doh. My name is Omar. I want to play blocks. Hi, my name is Jason, and I like to play with Play-Doh. My name is Jolie, and I like about the YMCA that um, they do activities, and it's fun. My name is Carlos, and what I like about the YMCA is I get to hang out with my friends. Like from the YMCA, um, that we learn stuff, um, because we get to do fun stuff, and, um, and do art and stuff. What does the Y mean to you? My name is Yoreli and the YMC means it means to me like it's like a family to me. I think it improves self-confidence. It means social acceptance. My name is Karina Duran and what the YMC means to me is a place where I can come and hang out with people I love and homework time and clubs which was which are really successful and helped me improve in things that I want to do in my future and make, give me ideas of what I want to do in my future. My name is Blanca Saavedra. I'm in ninth grade and I've been in the YMCA program for about like two years. started coming in eighth grade. What the Y means to me is a place where I can come and finish my work from school. They help me out a lot. Anytime I need to finish something or just get on tasks, they help me with that. They also help me feel safe and this is an environment in which like any person would want to be in because it's fun and they help you excel in certain areas of work and it's just a place where I could come, uh, meet with my friends, uh, do programs, helps me with physical education, with anything with school, have really good programs here which help students learn and have fun. That's what the YMCA means to me. Hi, my name is Juan Carlos Vasquez, and um, I'm just gonna open up about the YMCA real quick. Um, I just got back from soccer practice, and that's something good that they do is they let us back in after soccer practice if we're in YMCA, and they'll let us eat and stuff like that, and they'll still feed us even though we've been gone and stuff like that. But other than that, more importantly is just the leaders that are there, like Jared, Lindsay, Wendy, and Shelby. They've all been a good, like, they've been a great part of the YMCA here in Highland. And they've been helping out a lot of kids with their problems and stuff like that. They'll discuss things with it without no hesitation. They're not scared to ask about stuff like that. And hopefully the students aren't scared too express themselves out in front of them but mostly for me the thing that's helped me the most is um it's i guess just a fun a fun place where to go you know i mean i feel a little bit safer or it's a lot safer and stuff like that but once once like i get out of school i'm like oh what am i gonna do and i remember i have ymca after school and i just go see what clubs there are and i'll go and try and enjoy it and for other kids, like I was saying, there's there there are a lot of kids here that have like a lot of problems, and they do come to Jared and Lindsay and them and ask for help, see if they can help them out with something like that. And I'm glad that these leaders are a part of this because maybe if there were some, if it was someone else, we probably wouldn't feel as safe anymore. And it's, and that's the whole thing about YMCA is feeling safe and having fun, you know, and yeah. We eat together, we work together, and we also have a lot of fun together. Well, the Y means a lot to me. Like, you can go there and just be yourself and no one will judge you.